A group of Italian archaeologists, grad students, and their patrons stand in the midst of a giant Egyptian tomb. The famed University of Central Missouri expedition has just discovered the legendary tomb of Pharaoh Nebuchadnezzar IV. Nebuchadnezzar was an incredibly powerful female pharaoh of the Sixth Dynasty. For much of his life, Dr. Cutter had searched for the ancient ruler of Egypt's old kingdom. As they stand around the sarcophagus looking at Nebuchadnezzar's mummy, celebration soon turns to argument. I must say, Dr. Cutter, that my faith, not to mention my fortune, has been greatly rewarded by your find. Why, thank you, Countess de Money. That's Monet, Doctor. What? Oh, <laughs> oh sorry. Countess de Monet. <laughs> I must confess, I was beginning to despair at ever finding this archaeological treasure. I spent the better part of 50 years trying to discover this site. If it wasn't for your family's continuous support over the years, I may never have been able to find Pharaoh never cares to. I know that has been hard on you in recent years, Kata, but I must say that your finds were more than we could the investment that we've made in your quest. By what do you mean, recoup? Mr. McDoo. That's sir, to your name, and I meant exactly what I said. Countess de Monet's family has invested a considerable sum of money into Dr. Carter's endeavors, and now it's time that we get a hard return on our investment. See? <laughs> <laughs> that belongs to the Egyptian people. And we will not leave this country. <laughs> What about the cat? If any who leave here with Queen Nebuchadnezzar's treasure shall be killed! Now, now, now! Everyone, calm down. You are really ruining a rare moment of supreme discovery. Ali, there is no curse. That is simple right and not dead. I will not go down and start the cargo! Curses and its 
ill-mannered folks. Victor? Yes, Countess? Please be a gentleman and escort me out of this oversized cellar. I trust that you will have the papers drawn up asserting my right to this treasure? Most assuredly, my lady. You, sir, shall be hearing from me soon enough. No, no, hold on a minute. <laughs> Whatever. The fact remains we found the biggest stash of loot in Egypt. We're all filthy rich. Not you too? After all we've been through? Exploring the lost tunnels under the German? Finding a lost room in the sea? Fighting up hordes of Bedouin raiders and, and becoming story material for millions of whole stories. Does that mean nothing to you? I thought you cared about me. Are you kidding, Hunter? You think I give a fig about you and your scam discoveries? Without me, you're nothing. I'll ruin your reputation and make sure that all the glow, all the glory, not so much of the gold, will be mine. Now you hold on, Dr. Frank, if that's really your name. You better watch yourself, little girl. There are more dangerous things in these tombs than scorpions and ass. Dr. Cutter is a good man and a great Egyptologist. You've lived off of the Ed for three years, and I'm not about to let you get away with it anymore. Please, Carlotta. Like you're really a grad student? We all know you're secretly a government agent who is only protecting the good doctor because it's your job. Or the rumors could be true. What rumors? Tell me, Carlotta. Who have you been spending your nights with? Now be here, Dr. Frank. Save it, Carl. Save it, Cutter. Be ashamed of yourself. Carlotta is half your age. Are you following me? Are those guys in your wheel? Oh dear. What am I going to do? It certainly isn't that day, old girl. My. You certainly could use. Some moisturizer. <laughs> 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 <laughs>